Hello everybody, Puzzle Piece is back with more of Sherlock Holmes Chapter 1. And in the last video, we had done some fighting, but I failed terribly at it. I ruined my keyboard. Well, not ruined, I, I have stickers where the letters are because that's how much I type. The letters are gone, so I have stickers to replace the letters. And the stickers, I was so into the fight that the stickers uh broke <laughs> so um yeah so we had met oh no um, this one so we had met the boyfriend and from that yeah we met him paul perks and uh they're actually a woman uh, disguised as a man to achieve higher social position, which makes sense, especially back then. Um, which is the sad, unfortunate truth. Um, nature... I'm just reminding myself because it's been a little while. Um, so at least, yeah, we got that. Uh, yes, they were doing drugs. Or not doing drugs, they're smuggling drugs. Oh yeah, we're still looking for books. And... That club... Yeah, I was attacked by criminals who were after Paul. Uh, he owes me an explanation. Um, yeah, so I guess we're now trying to figure out... Oh, yes, we had this from the last thing, too. So, let's see here. Uh, dead. Maybe, the, maybe these two? Nope. Elbow swollen. Oh! There we go. Yeah, because we think that maybe they're... Unknown third party. Right, okay. So, we now need to... I mean, do we ask her about it? Imogen, I mean? Are they still there? Or did they run off? I actually can't remember. So let's see if, um, if Paul is still there. <laughs> this bench is just covered in flowers. The gangplank? Yeah, let's see if Paul is still here. Oh, they're in the... they're in there. Okay. Open. There we go. Hi, Paul. We need to talk. Your fellow mariners have a strange way of showing hospitality. They were not my friends. <laughs> Are you sure? I would rather risk my neck for someone who's at least honest and thankful. Perhaps, then, don't enter someone's life and be so judgmental, pretending you're better than they are. Then give me your perspective and allow me to see through your eyes. What were you doing yeah. this morning, Miss Perks? Don't call me that. I'm a champion. I was sailing. The other club members told me that you missed the race this morning. Do champions uh. not need to practice? Oh, you've talked with them already. No, no. but we're just going to say that. I visited the doctor after that attack on me, and then I had to honor the deal with the bandits you just took care of. I tried to tell you before, but your partners interrupted. Have you heard the news? Theodore Gildon is dead. Do you have anything to say? Well, what a shock. To me, he was an angry old ogre. Good riddance. Oh. Was it Goliath that killed him? Goliath, crush that's right. Him? Break his bones? Come on, tell me. I want all the details. You have an unusual way of showing grief. Imogen wouldn't appreciate that. Mm -hmm. But yes, the animal could have been involved. It's poetic in a way, isn't it? It takes a beast to kill a monster. I wish I could have been That's kind of neat. Elephant. This business of yours, you should be more careful. <laughs> I like how they're both cross-armed. Such a young age is ridiculous. 
I am careful. Except for you, no one has noticed where I store the smuggled goods. If the police arrive, there's no link to me. It's common storage, not exclusively mine. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, let's provide some evidence. Uh... Yeah, maybe this. You smuggle illicit psychotropes on your yacht. Not a delivery for the hospital, I'm sure. Of course not. I've had to cut corners to earn some money. How might a person afford to pay for a yacht in an honest way? Mm. I don't know, although I'm smart. The buyers are my customers. Adults who are willing to pay for their pleasure, or weapons for jewels. Whatever oh, they want true. me to deliver. Nothing criminal. Well, it's your lucky day. I'm not here because of smuggling. Have you tasted this tea yourself? I wouldn't have been a champion if I had used it. Mm. It's just a side business that keeps my career afloat. It's quite expensive to compete in yachting. Sometimes I cut corners. Such as fixing whirlpool yourself? Exactly. And sometimes I just have to pay. That's how I earn money. I don't sell slaves or take the last mangir from a poor family. Okay. Yeah, let's ask them about this. It seems as though Theodore Gilden hung a sword of Damocles over your life and career. Were these only words or something more serious? Pfft. Check my forearm. Pulled muscles and bruises. Small cuts. Nothing that you could call serious. I doubt that a man in his late fifties could wrestle you. It wasn't him. He behaved like a rat and hired brutes. Ah. His boys tried to lock my hands behind my back, but I was faster and I escaped. Was he so protective of his daughter, or was it your feminine secret that provoked him? My guess is that he was protecting his property. As he saw it, he owned Imogen, and he treated her like a piece of furniture. He didn't want his daughter to be loved by anyone. Mm. What's more painful is that Theodore didn't allow me to love his daughter. Typical. I'm not sure that your relationship with Imogen could be described as typical. Are you afraid of a woman in trousers? <laughs> now that's typical of men. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> uh, all right. Bandage. Oh, yeah. I don't know what this means. Oh, okay. Well, we already asked about that. Yeah. Look what I found. Box full of darts. Hey, that's mine. Yeah, we know. <laughs> I confiscated it. These darts appear to be filled with something. Poison? How powerful is it? It's strychnine. Ooh. Enough to instantly kill a small rodent. Uh. I haven't tried it on a human. Yet. I hope you know what you're doing. Could it immobilize a larger animal? Say, an elephant? I've never tried. But I have wondered. Okay. Yeah. A charming picture. I've heard that champions do often pose with their trophies. Ooh. It is a lovely trophy, though. I'm sure you will agree. What is it that you like most about her? Her naivety? Oh. Her father's money? A somewhat difficult choice. Especially now that her father is out of the equation. Well, that... Oh yeah, packed bags. Imogen doesn't strike me as an industrious young lady, so I find it strange that she was busy packing up all her belongings when Mr. Gilden died. That's some um, favorable wind in your sails, isn't it? Is it so suspicious that a couple might embark on a trip? I wanted to thank her, so we plan to go traveling. A Theodore-free place without elephants. The timing of it is suspicious, however. Yeah. Your lady friend becomes an orphan and heir and there's a planned trip directly afterwards. An improvised romantic dinner will never please a spoiled girl. A planned voyage might. It's not spur of the moment. Yeah, let's ask them about that. Does this knife seem familiar? I didn't find it in your competitor's back, to be clear. This knife is as blunt as your humor. 
It's a boson's knife, but it's not mine. I wouldn't be so careless as to mislay my tools. Okay, so it's not theirs. I mean, I don't think they'll say anything about it, but let's see. I don't know what this means. Oh, okay. So I think we're pretty good then. I have to leave you for a moment. Don't sail too far away. All right. Let's see for a minute here. Let's get our clues and things straight. Gonna clear these. I am a little curious to see if Imogen knows that. Um, sorry that uh, Paul is female, but. I mean, if anything, we can go back and talk to her about it. Let's see here. Travel. Water. You know, stay hydrated while you're solving mysteries. Do, do, do. Let's see. Okay, let's pin the right thing here. Uh, yeah, let's do that. And then... Oh, right. Nothing to say about this. I have nothing <laughs> to say about this. Oh, okay, well at least you know we're just going through it then. Okay, so I guess yeah, there's nothing then. I have to leave you for now. Okay. Just trying to think then. as to what we do and where to go. Okay, so we're not disclosing that Paul's a woman. Okay. Yeah, so careful with their tools and never mislay them, so okay. Is there something I can do with the smuggling? Trying to look and see. Oh, 
Oh yeah, there was something else we had. Notes. Okay, that's the vampire thing. Don't I have an area for pictures? thinking of <laughs> and everyone's like we don't know we don't know what you're thinking of a partnership annulled with a single stroke of a pen Sorry. <laughs> Trying to work around things here. Angle. Wish I could move that chair. <laughs> Something A Swift? So? Something about a catchy title. What's so special about this place? Another elephant? Not moving here. Hmm. Okay. S salt, I think. Oh, ivory baths. That... that it? I'm trying to remember what the walkthrough was wanting me to wanting me to do. Let's sit there. I mean, I can't do anything until I get outside, but... I mean, it has something to do with the plan the the building plan there the ivory va I ivory baths there we go uh so here okay 
Kent City Hall. Where's the... It's a church. The police station. Gonna something, but eh, let's try it. I mean, if at least not there. Then we can try the uh, police station and then the city hall. We haven't been to city hall yet, though. All right, let's see. People. Section. Hmm. Yeah, but that's the other thing too. We don't have anything to go on. Like there's no there's no book. That's what I'm trying to say. There's no book. Let's try then. Oh. Police station. Because, uh, again, they have the. They have the exclamation mark. I mean, that something needs to be done here, but I don't know what. Oh, it's a new case. Oh, okay. What did I pick up? The Coley Shangles. Okay, so basically it's just people... ...drunken. Drunken stuff. Oh, Sailor was stabbed to death in fight at the Golden Hill located the Any further investigation? Okay, well. Uh, <laughs> kind of hoping for a little different direction, but... Thinking maybe... No? Okay. Hmm. It's, uh, it's a bit of a puzzle. Um, alright. So we're gonna try... Oh, well, the exclamation mark's gone now. Oh, that must have been because of the... Okay. Yeah. Probably because of the, um... The case that we got there. Over here? Does it look remotely familiar to you? Should it? Concentrate, Sherry. Oh. Oh, hello. Um, alright. Well, in the next 
uh, video, we're going to figure out why this looks so familiar. So do stay tuned. This is Puzzle Pieces signing off.